Hello everyone, it's Kangaroo here, and today we're doing another mod review. Uh, welcome, and chill here, for, chill here for a moment while I'm just going at the truck. So uh, I've put a new mod in. We're going to do a mod review again on your truck simulator too. So we're just going to get the truck. I think it's in in the Daffod dealer, but I'm just going to go through all the dealers until I find it. So, um, we'll try with DAF to start off with. If it's in here, we can just take it, can't we? Uh, there it is. There is the <laughs> first one on the list. And there it is. There's the Kenworth T800. It hasn't loaded yet. But we can't. We just click on it and we'll customize it. And then we can see it. Let's just wait for it to load. Yeah, just give it a minute and it'll be there. Oh, don't give it a minute, give it a few minutes, <laughs> a few seconds. Then it should be uh, sorted. I have a lot of stuff on this computer. You know, I have two hard drives. Wow, look at that. That is, that is really good. Nice truck. I like the red on it though, I really love that. So cabin, we can't do anything with the cabin, even though it says one pound on it. <laughs> one pound to change the cabin. Oh, he was having the right. I bet he was having the right laugh when he was doing this. Another one pound if if you were to uh, uh, wait. There's nothing to upgrade, so I guess doesn't matter. Oh, we got some more realistic um, payments. So we've got the cat with the question mark on it. Change it to that if you want. I mean, there are quite a lot of options. Uh, you can change it to hit six, 600 horsepower, I think, if you wanted. The thing is, I want a pretty um, decent engine, but not too fast, but not too slow, you see what I mean? So I'm probably going to go with the cat or the... no. If you saw my other mod r review the other day, oh, excuse me, um, we had another truck, and I took the cat engine in it. Wasn't it a Freightliner Coronado? Yeah, I had a choice of a cat or a I can't remember the other one or another engine as well. There was two other engines, but I choose chose the cat. This time though, I want to choose the red. ISX 15500, whatever that is. I guess the 500 represents 500 horsepower. But before on on the freight line, I took some. I took the cat, and there were two other options. One of them was this type here, this red. So I'm going to take this red red ISX 15500, 500 horsepower. Even though the RPM is actually quicker in the cat, I'm going to take this one because I don't know what it's going to sound like. Even though there's 550 there, that 550 horsepower ISX 15 550 is the same as that cat C15 500. So. Uh, I'm just going to go with that one. Yeah, end of. So I went with a 500 horsepower X. Yeah, you can see it on there. Take a look at it. Note it down if you want it. Let's carry on. So that's the 13 speed gearbox because I guess it says 13 there. I'm going to go on though and take the 18 because I feel like it. And that's what proper Kenworths normally have. So, um, I think they do anyway. Uh oh, uh oh, I think it's about to freeze. Oh no, we're in, we're in. We are in. Ooh, I like the dials. I love the dials. It's ace. Now, we have the modern one. Still one pound. Who cares? <laughs> I don't know, I'd, I'd bet um, the guy that was actually modding this 
probably thought, I don't give a damn about whether how much money uh, you have to mod them for. It's only a game, probably, he was probably thinking when he did this. But, um, one pound to, uh, to upgrade your interior seems a bit odd, really. But it doesn't matter. Uh, exclusive, though. Hmm. Hmm. Now, what's behind us? I feel like there's something behind us and we're missing it. No, I can't see behind us. So does it change any of these? Do, do, does it change the lever? Or the seats? No, it just changes the dash by the looks of it. So I'm going to go with exclusive, I think. Because that is the top model, I guess. That's what the mod modder obviously thinks is the top model. So I've gone with exclusive on there. I know it looks a bit rubbish, but I don't know. Really, it's 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 okay. It's okay. Now there are different. We can't in black, but oh, I don't want black. I have it in blue. I don't really like the blue though. I think I'm just going to go with the standard red. I think the red looks best in this truck, actually. Uh, accessories then. <laughs> By the looks of it, there are loads of accessories for this truck. So this may take some time, but chill. I mean, you aren't recording this. Uh, standard bumper chrome. What's happened there? I don't like that. It looks that looks all meaty and fine, and then when you put this on, it looks like it's. I don't know. It just looks random and weird, really. So I'm not going to change any of that. Uh, we definitely need some guidelines here. Does it sort of fit in with the truck? Because if if basically what happens, I think the. The add-on should fit with the truck's style, if you see what I mean. Um, so, yeah. That's what I think, anyway. Front mud flap. Well, that looks pretty cool. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. I'm going to put another one over there for that. And then what's here? Imagine if we put one of those there. It just would look stupid. And not many things that we can put on there. Whoa! Oval amber LED light. But it's a huge thing on there. I don't think they're meant to go there, are they? They look odd. And they don't look like they should actually be there. What's that? A side bumper marker l light right. Bumper marker light. I'm just going to put one of those on because otherwise we're going to... It's going to look a bit stupid, I think. And we will have... Some of these just across here. I'm going to put a few like that. It does take a time modding, but it's all worth it in the end. You, you know, your truck looks, you know, ace in a way after this. Instead of looking like some kind of basic standard truck. But, of course, if you've just started out in Euro Truck Simulator 2, you won't be able to do this. However, I will have sometime soon, or sometime, hopefully in the future, a way of showing you how to get all this money and how to 
get all this stuff. They're just mods. You, you need to get onto the Euro Truck Simulator 2 website to get some proper money and mods. Which you'll really enjoy it once you got some mods on there. But have two profiles. I tell everyone this. Have two profiles. That's so that you can, if the profile fails that you're using at the moment, um, you can basically then yeah the mod mod f profile so the ones that you've got mods on may be corrupt when you put them on and then sometimes the whole profile can be corrupt and you can't use it so just be careful when you put mods on I would say have two profiles I have like three on here or four so just make sure whoa we've got a few so we've got quite a lot of that's quite cool isn't it well we can have that and that's a light apparently just looks a bit um, that's LED isn't it and it's not if it's not, look at that okay now that looks way better than the red one because if we put the red on now it looks like there's too much red and that stands out way too much and you've already got the red logo above it so I'm thinking somewhere along along the lines of that what is this going to do? oh look on the side there Kenworth oh, the modder that has done this you could just have that, that's the basic option but I'm going to have that look at that It's ace. So now we need to put the bumper. What's this? Bugs. Ah. Now. That's to stop the bugs hitting the screen, I guess. Uh, actually, that's an there's another reason they have that as well. When you're driving along, sometimes the lights on the car in front of you can be quite, what's the word, um, annoying. Because they're sometimes quite bright and that stops some of the light coming through, so it's really good. Uh, where's, where, I just put that light, um, mirror on that side, I now need this one there we go it's all sort of looking cool at the front now how to move along air clean, ah that puts that on the side of there this is looking cool the modder that has made this truck, well done so far, I'm really impressed. I was just taking a sip of my drink so my lips don't dry, go dry when I'm talking to you. Main mirrors, they are standard, but they look awesome, so, and they're chrome anyway, so. The guy that owns this truck in real life would have his you know, his daily job of cleaning all this chrome you will be there, you know, that would be one of his daily jobs uh, what is that though? oh right, okay so Mirage puts these accessory slots on and you can put horns and raw I'm going to go with the raw I just, I just feel like it, I haven't even had a look at it I don't think we need more lights, I mean Now what is this up here? Smoke <gasps> We've got smoke I bet it's, come on let it be better than It's all gone jerky Right, okay, there's too much smoke. 
at the moment. I'm going to put that on last because it's made it all jerky for me and I can hardly move my mouse. Come on. That's a bit CPU intensive, I think. Right, I'll put that on at the end. Uh, let's. What's that there? Is that the same thing we've just done? Wings? Ah. Hmm. So we could have that, okay? Which I don't, I don't like the look of actually. Well, we could have that. That looks way better, doesn't it? I, ju I just don't like that. It looks too. What they've done there is basically taking another truck, another camera. I can't remember the model of it, but they've taken. I think they've taken another truck's hood and then slapped it on top. It doesn't look right. That looks way better though. I'm sorry. If you're saying, no, kangaroo, don't do that. Um, it's too late, I've done it now. What's this up here? I can't reach. Uh, wings again. It's at the back now, we're at the back. Ooh, looking very nice, I have to say. Rear wheels. Well, we could have the Goodyears um, on there. But... I don't know. Let's put the Goodyears and see what they look like. Well, you have loads more. Um, good year tires. Mm, let's let's try, right? Okay, let's go with the standard ones. Not standard, but they were something else. Yeah, these Alcoa. They may look better. That's what I'm thinking. They may look better. Okay, they look. I think they look better. But if you don't think that, leave comments below. And when I do the next video of this, I th I'll change it. Depending if I do a next video on this. So um, anyway, we need to add the smoke, uh, which is quite CPU intensive. So. It will go jerky for a minute, I think. Let me check, there's no more modifications around the back before I end this. Modification of this truck. It all oh, looks brilliant, this truck. Yeah, there's... There is, you know, quite a lot that you can do to it as well, and it's quite put, you know, you can... Mod quite a lot of it at the front, which is cool. Right then, let's confirm our order and get out of here. So then, we need to purchase that truck and we need to send it to. We haven't got many. We'll send it to Lee. Oh, uh, no, 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 no. Um. Ah, uh, Calais. Calais hasn't got much. Okay, yes, I didn't mean to do that. Come on. I just want to get driving the truck, really. <laughs> what else would you want to do? Okay. Oh, it's raining in Calais as well. 
Even though we're like... Why under the map? Or something. I know that's just outside of the map. Where's my garage here? Don't land the truck on the roof, because I don't want to save it from the roof. It doesn't matter, because I won't be driving this truck in it, so it doesn't matter if it's... Enter, yeah. Okay, let's get the camera out. Time for it to have its maiden... A maiden, maiden voyage. Don't think that's the words. Um, drive it. Of course, I want to drive it. I spent a lot of money on that truck, even though the interior was one pound. <laughs> Just give it a minute to load. See, I've got, I've got this uh, mug here. It's a huge mug, by the way. Uh, it says all sorts of different. What was that? <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa! We need to cont We need to look at the truck instead of looking at what I'm doing. Watch up there. Whoa, that is ace. Turn the lights on to see what it looks like. Not bad. Smoke coming out of the exhaust aren't bad. Oh no, <laughs> I just drove it into the side of the... Oh, this truck is amazing! Oh, this is ace! I bet, I bet, I've still got, I've got... You know, I can't really say it's amazing just yet. Because I have got things to test, like with every single view in the truck, we need to test that well, there we go, that's one of the views that I worry about it's a tr I'm try as I try and um, look around the back sometimes they don't mod it properly but that's absolutely fine, I can look around the back I'm sure I can, oh look at this beautiful Me putting the handbrake on off if you want to know what that sound is. It's nice. Very nice. Anyway. Um it's time to Anyway, yeah, it's time to get on the road. Test this truck out properly. You know that there's yeah, that is quite cool. Look at the look at the sat nav now. It pops out. You can do it properly and just put it on and then start the engine. That's uh that's really cool. Anyway, do the wipers work? Yay! The wipers work! Yay! We do actually have a truck that has the wipers working on it. This is so cool. I actually drew in a Kenworth. Hmm. 
for quite a long time actually, so I'm quite looking forward to this. So we need to go and get a job. Okay, uh, I really actually wanted to be in the UK. But I don't think it really matches, does it? Really? Doesn't matter where we are. Um, we'll go to London and see what they've got. That's not London, Andrew. Um, uh, where are we going to? We've not got. Right, we'll go to Brazil. I mean, oh, I don't want to go to. Um, do I want to go to Casco? I want to go to a place that I haven't really been to. And that is in one sentence, so that... Ah, there we go. Vaca... I think I spelled that right. V-A-C. E A is that a, a Oh, I need to go to I'm doing everything wrong today. Yeah. God it's raining everywhere. Honestly, this is Another place that is raining. I mean, don't I don't want to. Settle it down. Probably needs to turn around and go back. Uh, it's automatic, uh, so I'm not in control of the actual gears at the moment. Huge vehicle. The turning circle is massive. Yeah, I did. I think we put some air horns on here, actually. We need to test those out sometime soon. I'm sure I've discovered this place now. So I need to go and find a job. Um, we don't want to go far. Let's fine because I want to test this truck out and then I want to do some editing and then go to bed I guess <laughs> no actually watch TV and then go to bed so there we go that's my uh, plan for the day or rest of the rest of the day
It's gonna be in here, isn't it? Probably set off and then I'll probably split this into two parts. And then, yeah, that'll be it. For the day. Which way are we going out? Because if it's that way. Seriously, how am I going to... Let's do some jiggling here. free? Yeah, I'm free. Right everyone, I think that will be it for today, so thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed this video so far, there's always the subscribe button on my YouTube channel, so go and click on my logo and you can find it there. Um, thank you very much for watching, um, and I will see you in the next video of this, when we test it properly, and it's driving. I haven't really driven it so far yet today, so um, that's going to be interesting. But thank you very much for watching everyone, I'll see you next time, subscribe, subscribe like, my pay, like my videos, um, and you can do anything, it's all yours. Alright, thank you very much for watching everyone, bye bye.